What's up guys and gals and welcome back to the kitty hood. We're out here banging on other kitties just making it happen I've knocked out so many kitties today, but we are a little beat up So that's the downside to knocking out kitties all day long But at the same time our kitty goes hard in the paint man. You can't mess with him He decides a neighborhood is his and that neighborhood is his he gets down in town clown He does this thing. I welcome on back to cattails if you wanted to get this game check out the link down below um, What is this box over here? Can I break this? I guess I can't break that box. I wanted to. I tried really hard to get it broken, but I guess my kitty claws just aren't enough. Can I do anything with that right there? What oh, there's a mouse over here. Hold on. We're going to get him. We're going to get him. Ah! We're terrible at hunting. I need to make my hunting skills better. Hold on. Can I get better at hunting right now? Yeah, make me better at hunting. I think my fighting is going pretty well. I do like four damage a hit, so it's not too bad. I don't know what foraging does. So use to find herbs, flowers, and berries determines the effect of the plants when you use to heal and invigorate. Oh. Okay, cool. Well, now that I know what that does, I suppose... We'll oh, there's a temple over here? The sacred temple. This place is apparently like our UN. It's like a safe zone. You can't fight over here. Hello, I don't think I've seen you around before. My name is Ellie, at least at the moment. What's yours? Ollie, huh? Not bad. Could use some work, but not bad. Sorry, I don't take it personally. It's my job to critique names. I'm what you might call a name changer. Ever think of a great name that you really wish other people would start calling you? I can fix that by changing yours. Of course, there is a fee. There's a lot of papers to fill out and file, and all that takes some time. Are you telling me cats have a bureaucracy? I don't feel like cats are the kind of animals that would have bureaucracy, unless it was purely to make other animals upset. Like, I feel like they would hate bureaucracy, but they would only implement it if they could guarantee that it would troll X amount of the population to make them upset. I visit the sacred temple on third day of every season. I'll be seeing you around. Keep in mind, if you're feeling like a fresh name with Spice Up Low. Okay, so I guess it's the third day of every season. All right. I don't know what I'm doing over here. Let's take a look at our map and figure out where we want to go. Uh, so that area is enemy territory. They tried to attack over here, but I'm down for the set, man. I'm down for the set. I'm trying to make it so that we control everything out her. Out per? I don't know. We control everything out per. Uh-oh. This water's looking kind of dangerous. Oh, we made it. Oh, my God. I didn't realize there was going to be a current. That's never happened before. I'm actually sort of horrified if I have to follow. Oh, dude. Am I in the middle of something? I am. I'm in the middle of something that's about to go bad for me. Oh, no. We'll try to go diagonal right here. Maybe that'll help. There we go. Going diagonal seems to have fixed the problem up just fine. I don't know who wants this territory, though. That water sucks. That water almost sucked me down to the bottom and murdered me. Oh, we can catch rabbits, too? Ooh. Uh, what's going on in the map right now? I wanted to see what this little area up top was, but it's getting kind of late right now. I wonder if anything different happens at night. I wonder if it's a good idea to run around at night or not. We'll try it. We'll stay out tonight and see what happens. We got some Valerian root right there. I think Valerian was the thing that allowed us to claim a territory. Oh, it energizes and invigorates you. So, plus 10 movement speed, but I'm hungry. Eat a squirrel. I'm sure that'll fix the problem. Oh, yeah, that made me a lot faster, and it sped up my animations, too. Do I see any critters around here that can be caught? Some of them seem to see me a lot before I get over there, so I'm just trying to make sure. Oh, is this a graveyard over here? What is this? I think those are just normal stones on the ground. But it looks like there's, like, a, a desert biome over here, maybe? And a street lamp. That's weird. What's inside this cave? Can I do anything with these? Anything bad happen when I smack those mushrooms? There's like a crystal over here. Okay, what does the crystal do? I wonder if... Uh-oh. Wait, 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 wait. What do you want? Ah, wait a minute. You're not a mole. You're a cat. Sorry to burst out at you like that. It's just you woke me up from my nap, and I get cranky when folks wake me up. Anyways, you look confused. Let's get the introductions out of the way. I'm Molu, and I run the Prairie Quarry. Got lots of laborers down in the mines below us, digging for gems and other pretty-looking rocks. We're always looking for more help if you got time. You want to get your paws dirty? If you can bring back some gems, I'll reward you. You'll probably have to dig deep before you start finding the good stuff, though. You can mine by swiping with your claws at the big rocks. I pay mole cash in exchange for gems. You can trade the mole cash at my shop for some of the stuff I've collected. Your mews are no good to me, though, but my laborers may be interested in them. That entrance behind me is where you'll want to go to start mining, and uh, make sure you pack a lunch to take with you before you go in, since you get hungry fast mining all those rocks. I've heard there might be some bats on the lower levels, too. Hopefully they don't bother you, but ah, uh, you never know. Let me know if you got any questions. Remember, I pay mole cash for your gems, so bring them back to me. Okay. So I guess this is like a little mining zone. Dude, we gotta get some health back. We're a little beat up right now. I'm gonna catch this mouse, though. You better come back over here. You're just gonna get pinned in a corner. I'm telling you. Yup, see what happens? Oh, it was a squirrel. What's a squirrel doing down in the mines? 
Either way, we trapped him and we moitered him. I'm going to get this one too. Oh, I was trying to get that one too, but no. Life won't give me squirrels. This is why I'm a spiteful creature. This is why my cat is going to walk through life just grumpy and mad all the time. Because life won't give me squirrels. Uh, we could probably pan through this zone right now. It's 9 o'clock, so it's going to be getting darker as time goes along. What's up with this big rock over here? There's some more golden seal. Doesn't look like I can do anything with the big rocks. I was hoping maybe I could paw at them or break them or something. What is this? Is there anything inside the hole of that tree right there? I don't know if I could climb up inside of it or something. Anything else going down in this region right here? We got like some old Roman architecture. Just trying to beautify the population out here. Make sure the kitties have stuff available that they want. Uh, can I catch that crow right there? What happens if I catch a crow? Oh, I got him! I wasn't expecting that to work. I don't know, half the time when I pounce on something, it doesn't work. And so, like, I don't think my skills are high enough to catch most things. I underestimate what I'm capable of, you know? Start getting worried. I'm gonna go back into Mystic Colony, and maybe there'll be... I don't know if there's a storyline or anything else, or if it's just kind of like a cat sandbox, and you just sort of do your thing. Ah, I would like to save my game, because we did Kitty War today, and it worked out pretty well. And then I'm gonna take myself a little cat nap. Although, from my experience, my cats tend to be awake during the night. They run around like crazy during the evenings. Uh, it gave us a little bit of health back. I think we're probably going to have to use... We probably want to stay out of combat, maybe? So there's two battles going on. There's one to the west, and there's one to the south. I don't know if I want to do that. Like, we don't have a lot of money right now. Well, we have some. Maybe it'll pay for my medical bills. I'm going to talk to Crampy. Uh, yeah, heal me, son. Yup, treat me fully. Let's do this thing. Get all treated up. Done! All right, so let's go back out. We're going to assist with the war effort. See if we can get something banging out here. And if we can make that work for us. I don't know what the benefit is of having more territory. Or even if I should be concerned about, like, taking territory. I don't know. Ah, oh, he saw me. Damn! Uh, some Valerian right there, though. I think that's good for energizing the kit. Oh, shit. There's a big-ass war going on over here. All right, jump in on the combat. Jump in on the combat. Let's go. What you got for me, kitty? What you got for me? Nothing. I got nothing. What's going on? Yup, we keep it bracken out here. You don't even know. Give me my kitty gold. I gotta pay my medical bills. Alright, so we got some kitty gold. But the battle did not go the way that I wanted it to. Use some golden seal. Get your health back. We may still be able to swing this thing. Eat your turtle meat too, because I've got a feeling that might make you feel better. And so like... Let's see what's going on with you right now. I'm trying to rotate. Make sure this dude don't get ahead of me. I'm not trying to get knocked out either. Uh-oh, we're getting... Oh, we got homies! There's a homie right out on him, homie! Oh, Chester and Ombre are here. I wonder if they won their battle and that's what happened. Got a little bit of XP for choking that dude out. This guy's definitely the damage hitter, though. We won the battle over here in the Westlands, so this is still our territory. And we got to go back over and defend this territory down here. What's up, Ombre? How you doing? I made up my mind to try and sneak away from borders and see how far I can get before another cat finds me. It's dangerous, but exciting. Yeah, that's... That's living that life, man. That's like creeping across the tracks late at night. You may not want to do that. You run around claiming Susu and get bucked on. Might get ugly. Kitty's out here twisting fingers, dude. They're going hella hard. These cats are getting action out here. I don't really know what else I should be doing, though, aside from, like, just normal cat stuff, like hunting and running around. There's a bird over there. I might be able to catch that. Oh, I missed. I almost had him. How much XP do I have right now? 37? Make my hunting a little bit better. Yeah, make my hunting a tad more solid. Keep those meters moving on up. I bet swimming just makes you swim faster. I wonder if I can get this frog over here. Yeah, got him. Took that toad out. I wonder if I can catch a fish now. If I'm good enough to catch fishes. Did I get him? I don't know if I got him. I think he dove. I think he got out of the way. What is this right here? Is this useful to me? Oh shit, there's a big ass battle going on over here. I mean, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna participate like hard stop. Oh no, kitty! I was No, my soul got sucked out! These kitties are using some dank ass magic. There's still hope. What will you do? Uh, be revived by the doctor? Summoning all your willpower, you will awaken once more. Dude, kitty's getting dropped. I didn't know this was a life or death struggle. Ah, Ollie, your consciousness returns to the physical plane. It seems you may have dropped a thing or two when you fell. But you never fear, Dr. Crampy has revived your life essence. Stay safe. I'll meet you there. 
Wait, what's up with this cat over here? Is that cat like my mom or something? Like, how come he's always disappearing in like a puff of light every single time? Oh, I lost all my stuff. Can I go back and get it? Wonder if I can go back and get it. They claim that territory down there. They said I dropped some of my items. I dropped all of my items. I got nothing left right now. I'm broke as a joke. I should have just let myself die and reloaded the save. What did we learn? Ugh. Couldn't get this frog down here is what I learned. Got him though. Give me that frog. We're gonna need some health. I'm gonna need a little bit of food before we go any further. Man, that was all my butterflies and everything. I was feeling all hyped about myself. I was feeling chuffed. I felt like I was taking care of business and nope. We got blapped on by kitties that were way harder than us. He was hit for like six damage though and he took a bunch of damage and I kept expecting him to like go down and then he didn't. Like he just stayed on his feet. So I'm thinking that was like their Goliath or whatever. I'm not gonna catch him. I tried to get too close. Uh, I don't see any items around here that I can make use of. Is this the bottom of the map? I don't know if I want to go out to war again either. That didn't turn out great for me before. See, this is what happens when factionalism... That's what, what happened when tribalism comes out to the kitty sectors, man. What's going on over here? You trying to fight for our territory right now? And see, you get sucked right back in. You don't want to fight with people. They force you to. Come out here getting in all kinds of trouble. There we go. Get him, Juliet. Get him. Oh, they got numbers, though. Oh, they got mad numbers. Good lord. Retreat! Run away! They have the superior advance. Did I get that fish, though? Oh, they're better at swimming than me, too. Nope, I don't mess around with a cat that can swim. Uh, maybe I'll just walk around. Can I go to the other colonies? What happens if I go to another colony? Do I get jumped if I go there? Let's go find out while I've got, like, nothing to lose. I'll just kind of hunt and forage my way across the land. And we'll go check and see what they got going on at, like, Forest Colony and some of the other places. Oh, there's a highway over here, too. Oh. Okay. Can I get run over by a car? There's, like, a mouse over here. I'm going to try and catch this thing. Ah! He turned around at the wrong moment. No discernible pattern. Ah! He turned around on that one, too. Damn it! They always wander towards me. I'm so hungry. I just need kitty vittles. Please, let me have them. All right, we're going to catch him this time. We're going to catch him this time. This rat's done. Got him. That's dinner. We got a field mouse. We're kind of hungry, too. Uh-oh. They're still trying to mess with me over here. Dude, this isn't even like claim territory. Why are you trying to fight with me right now? It's like a demarcation zone. They're like, we don't care. This war carries over. Tell me I care. This kitty don't care. Kitty's out here banging. It's 5 o'clock. And I really couldn't make it to where I wanted to go. Ooh, there's a marigold over here. I'll take that. So it's probably a good idea to drop all of our stuff that we can inside of our den for later. Got a few more plants over here, but nothing that's looking too sexy or aesthetically pleasing. We got some raspberries. Can I eat those? What do I do with raspberries? They can be used as a quick snack. All right, they gave me 10%. It's better than nothing. I've been running off prey left and right, though. So there's the road right there. What's up with this big-ass toadstool? Can I do anything with it? Nah? Okay. Is this where I got left over here? I feel like this is the place where I got abandoned. This seems like familiar, emotionally upsetting territory. And I don't want to be emotionally upset today. I keep expecting there to be like a little bit more storyline or like something, I don't know, to work on. Maybe I should talk to other cats though. Maybe that's what it is. I talked to everybody in town and it didn't seem like anybody had anything for me to do. What is that? Like a, a woodchuck? Go get him. Oh, you didn't catch the woodchuck. You messed up, man. All you had to do was catch the woodchuck. And he ran up the tree. That river seems like it has a dangerous current. I'm going to leave that alone. A little bit of golden seal right there. A little bit more golden seal. Yup, yup. For 24 XP, we can get something upgraded, but I don't know if that's a wise idea. What is this over here? Is that the temple? That big shiny thing? There's a frog over here. I'm going to catch him. I'm going to catch him. Oh, how come you didn't pounce at him? Get him. Yeah, I got him. What is that right there? That firefly. Can I catch it? Oh, I could. I got a white firefly. All right. So I guess they hang out in different areas of the forest, possibly. It doesn't look like I get any kind of XP bonus or anything for catching them. But maybe I'll sell a couple of them. Maybe they're worth, like, muse or something. There we go. I think it's time for us to ditch out back to... We're pretty far out. But I did say I wanted to see what happened if I went to another colony. 
So let's see what happens if we show up on their front door, if they, like, bust on us, or if they try to, like, take us out, and if the war continues, or are we allowed to be in other locations? Ooh, that's a red firefly right there. There's a mouse on this side. Let's see if we can catch it. Come on. Got him. I definitely think a couple points in hunting are going to help you out in this game. It seems like even after like two points, our pouncing has gone way up. I didn't see much of a difference after one point, but the second point seems to be what sold it. Uh-oh. Mountain tribes over here causing problems. I don't think you can catch me, though. That's like one of those things. It don't matter how fast you are. If you got slow hands, you ain't tagging nobody. But get up out of there because Lilac's looking a little... She... Lilac's got crazy eye right now. Lilac's got a little bit of crazy eye. So we're up in a corner right here. Okay. I don't know if the river's going to block me from passage on this side, but I want to find out what's going on with Forest Tribe. Maybe, like, we're flat out just not allowed to hang out with them. Maybe that's the way cat politics go. I don't know. Oh, we didn't get him. I do want that green firefly right there, though. He's a little bit quicker than the other ones. There we go. Uh, green firefly. His name was in a different color. Uh-oh. Sox is trying to roll out on us. Nope. Not trying to play today. What do you think you're doing? You can't just waltz in here. This is Forest Colony. If you have official business to conduct with us, you'll have to go through me. Okay. What do you want? If you got a gift for the colony, you can hand it to me. Who are you? I don't even think I know you. I guard the Forest Colony, so watch what you're doing or we'll have a problem. Are they going to jump me if I try to walk in? Okay, apparently I'm not allowed in Forest Colony. Let me hoof my dumbass all the way back to where I came from while grabbing all the valerian and all the other good stuff that I can. I'm going to use one of those valerians too so that I can escape from these things. I'm going to eat a toad and then we'll eat a field mouse to get our health back up. And I've got 10% movement speed now so I should be able to get away from them. There's bunnies and things over here but like let me grab the white firefly and I'm going to go back home. Coco's at the temple right now so we can talk to Coco. You're here. Good. Now we just have to make sure there's no one else around. All right, it looks like we're alone. I'm about to show you a place I've never shown anybody else, and I think you might be able to help me. Follow me, Ollie, down into the temple ruins. Ooh, there's like a dungeon over here? Let's go see what's going on. This kitty likes adventure. Well, this is it, the temple ruins. Pretty neat, ain't it? Uh, this is where I live. Uh, I don't let most cats in here, but I made an exception for you. I don't know why, but it's something inside me is telling me you can help me with a small problem that I'm having. You see, I'm not the only one that lives here. These ruins are also the residence of a kindly nature spirit. The forest guardian watches, watches over all the wilds and maintains the balance between all living things. But now, the forest guardian is gone. Disappeared and vanished. One day the guardian was here, and the next day the guardian wasn't. The balance is broken. That's the last thing they said to me before they left. I don't know what to do. Maybe the forest guardian is weakening. Maybe it's just a test. But I think you might be the solution. We should bounce some ideas off each other. There's an old prophecy about the arcane pillars that line the halls of the temple ruins. You can find them all around this room. They look dark, or they look like dark standing stones. The prophecy says that the pillars have been endowed with some sort of power, but I haven't figured out how to activate them just yet. Maybe you would know? Now listen, I know it sounds crazy, but you have to try to get them working for me. Check them out, won't you? Alright, let's go check out the pillars. Let's see what's going on with them. Oh, what's up? What did, what did you do? What do you mean you don't know? Look at the arcane pillar. It's pulsing with light. How odd. It's like it's reacting. But to you, well, this is a step in the right direction. Whoa, you see those symbols above the pillar? What do you think it means? Maybe the pillar is trying to tell us something. I think I have an idea. Maybe you should collect those items and bring them to the pillar. That might be enough to activate the power and bring the forest guardian back. Maybe try to place the items at the foot of the pillar. That might just work. Okay, so three mice, two squirrels, one rabbit, and a hare. What does this one want? Or do I have to do them one at a time? I'm just glad that I found some kind of narrative direction. I'm just glad there's like something that I'm supposed to be working on along the way. So if I see rabbits and things around, I'll absolutely place them over there. But there's only the four pillars. There's a bunch of trees growing down here, even though there's no sunlight. I don't think trees would last very long in this environment. Like, I, I think they're, they're dendritic nature requiring that photosynthesis. Om nomin on the sunlight. I don't think that's going to keep. How much XP do I have right now? Not enough to upgrade hunting again. But I do think having more hunting skill is what I'm going to keep investing in. Since that's where, like, most of our cash money comes from, that's what I'm going to prioritize for right now. I don't see any animals down here that I can hunt. I don't see any forageables around that I can pull off of a tree. Yeah. What's south of here? Do we have, like, a war going on in this area? It looks like we've slightly taken this area, but not really... 
I wonder what actually swings the war in your faction's favor. Because it does look like we're getting some pushback right now. I'm going to go help out with this hit over here. And it looks like your faction actually like can't lose the fight unless you don't show up or something. Either that or just rolled over at the end of the night. Oh, Christ. There are a bunch of you dudes up in here. All right, I'm not trying to get clawed on right now. Bandit, what you want from me? Yup, give me your cash. Your kitty money is now mine. Uh-oh. Why are we always losing wars, man? Y'all need to hit the weight bench a little bit better. Like, ah! I'm like the only person out here with hands. Got paws. Got mitts. And unfortunately, they are not working out for us. We got a frog over here. I don't think we're going to be able to catch him, though, before this goes too live. I got no healing items, so until backup arrives, I don't think I'm going to be able to do much. Some marigold over on this side. I don't know if I can sell it or what I can do with marigold. What does marigold do? Uh, treats wounds over time. Oh. It makes me feel mo better? Yeah, go ahead and use that then. That might just be the ticket we need in order to get into a fight and walk away. Ooh, that one went down quick. We popped him in his jaw. That dude found out. Ooh, we took his gold coin too. Vicky's the slow one though. The slow ones always hit hardest. Yeah, slow ones are always the biggest risk. I think if I lead off, I can hit him before he hits me. Yeah, just like that right there. Done! We won the battle for our team. Squad! Rolling out on kids. Making it happen. They thought they could take this territory. Oh, that kitty drowned right there. That's unfortunate. I'm going to say F's up for kitties. F's up for the drowned kitty. Uh, on the map. We have another battle raging over here, but I don't really have any of the stuff that I need in order to do that. What is this? Can I put, like, a mouse on the ground or something? Because it looks like it wants me to put a mouse in it right there. Like, doesn't that kind of look like a mouse symbol right there? That's kind of what it looks like to me. I guess I'll just have dinner then. I'm not going to stress about it. We've got an extra golden seal right there. That should give us enough skills to get our hunting level up. And so let's add to that. We are a level 3 hunter now. All right. Hopefully that will help us wrangle some new game so that we can take it back and make one thing plain. That when we chillin' in the rain, these mouse are going to refrain and feel the pain. Ah, oh, that mouse didn't feel the pain at all. I got sexy new skills and you done ruined it, man. You ruined it. I was trying to be a baller right now. Out here just getting mice all day, every day. And nope. Can't let me have nothing. Didn't get that frog either. We should probably work on that, man. Oh, he's better at swimming than I am. No! Come back, froggy. I will catch you. There we go. I knew I could catch him. I just had to believe in myself. I had to reach way down and find my inner Walt Disney or whatever and make it happen. Uh, we came in through here. I think it's probably time for us to sleep. We've been having a rough day, but I'm going to see if I can make a little bit of money inside of here. Maybe upgrade the size of my inventory or do something persistent. Hey there, uh, let's talk. You interested in my merchandise? I have many rare items. Nope, I'm not interested in your merchant. Well, I'm sort of interested. What do you want for a firefly? You'll take one on a firefly? All right, I got too many of them anyways, so you can have them. There we go. Take them. I don't think I need many more of them. What's the difference between the red ones? The red one sells for two, and that one sells for four. Rabbit sells for seven. Healing Root sells for a bunch, too. Uh, yeah, I'll sell the... No, don't sell all of it. I don't want to... Oh, man, I sold off... It had them all. It was using a rubber band box on them. I didn't realize. Okay, well, if we got them once, we can get them again. Uh, you want some Valerian Root? I'll sell that to you, too. I don't really care about Valerian. I'm just trying to get paid. So there's a little bit more cash. And if we leave the store, what can we afford now inside of the shop? So he's got precious imported goods. Uh, we can get a new paint job. We can get conch shells. We've got tabby colors. We've got spikes over there we could buy so we could have a spiky. Ooh, we can get the beaky collar too. Yeah, I want one. I want to be just like Doug. I want to be like him. Oh, I got to make this happen. Can I go in other people's dens when they're home? I don't think I can. Nobody's awake right now either. Hmm... Like, I don't see any indicators or anything that there's going to be, like, a quest around here. So I just, I guess I'll just consider it not a thing that I can do for right now. If you like this game, this game is called Cat Tales. It's a feline RPG. So if you wanted to play the life of a feral cat and get out there and bust some heads and protect your territory and make stuff happen, uh, this would be the game that would allow you to do it. Uh, I've got the link for you down below. If you like this video, the easiest way to support the channel is just to hit that like button. Legitimately. Um, aside from that, thank you for stopping on in. It's been really, really fun. I will see you all later. Do you want to see more? If you want to see more, 
Hit me up. You know where I'm at. Bye.